And then one day, the world changed. It said, you want to see scary? I'll show you scary. And like that, it took away the thing we love most, the thing we need most, being together. Businesses closed. Hospitals were overwhelmed. The world seemed to stop. It asked for heroes, nurses and doctors and paramedics. But as they fought on one front, another appeared, as insidious as the virus itself. Testing and paperwork and supply chain issues. Creating barriers between the healthcare worker and the patient. Help us, they said, help us do our job. Because nowhere in a medical oath does it say anything about paperwork. So they sent in reinforcements, and they called it robotic process automation to clear a 160-day registration backlog in a single day, to provide more accurate test results in one-third the time, to reduce the screening time of healthcare workers to four hours from five days, to cut the processing time of an application from 45 minutes to five minutes, to accelerate the distribution of loans to help keep businesses alive. This isn't just about the coronavirus. It's about helping to solve the greatest challenges in medicine, business, life. Faster, more efficiently. Think about what's possible if we eliminate drudgery, time-wasted repetitive tasks. This is where hope meets technology, so that we can all go back to doing the greatest thing, the most valuable thing, the thing that says we're not afraid anymore. Bringing the world back together.